This is the best thing I have ever bought. itself I want to tell you um, something about getting in because it was quite unusual and quite hard process so okay it all started a few months ago when I discovered these universal remotes by the want company and then I really wanted to get one but the problem was that they stopped making them so I searched the whole eBay waiting for them um, I really wanted the extending version and the problem was that there were uh, very few but if I found one um, the seller didn't ship it to my country so I over uh, over some months I discovered that one um, it was from one seller from United States who was able to ship it to my country so let's get right into it okay so here is the box it's nothing special just a usual cardboard box here we have some writing what it can do the picture of it it in it, uh, its extended position the box is a little bit damaged, but who cares? I bought the Sonic, not the box. So let's open it. Okay, so first thing when you open it, you have this manual. Um, it tells you everything about it, how to use it, commands, everything, how to program it. And in the other side, you have a giant poster of it. Then we have this display stand. And of course, the Sonic itself. And it is amazing. I really do love it. I mean, that you could get, you can't get it anymore, sadly. A really nice metal replica for less than 200 euro. It is amazing. Just look at the detail on this thing. I know it's not really screen accurate replica, but it still feels so nice. It's so, so good. And there are some things which are screen accurate. Just look, for example, at these black spots here. This is screen accurate. Oh, focus, come on. See? And the fact that you can actually control your telly with it is just mind-blowing. And now let's get to the best part. The flick to open action. Just look at this. It feels so good. I mean, that you can actually flick it and it opens just like the 11th Doctor and 12th Doctor's actual sonic screwdriver. And even here it is highly detailed, this green core. You even have this ring here. Claws look quite good, even if they're hollow and not solid. 
Okay, so using the sonic is easy when you've programmed it. Now I've turned tele on. And I can easily use it to do whatever I want. If you don't like the buzzing, you can open the quiet control mode. So, now it just clicks when I use it. And yes, so that's it. And the Sonic has another mode. The FX mode. So what this mode does is, um, with this mode you can actually play with it. Um, just, you know, like Doctor. And if you um, double press and hold uh, on the second press, it will do different sounds when you do different moves with it. And the normal mode. You have quite a lot of this sound, so yes. Another thing you can do in FX mode is if you push the button two times and then hold it on the third time, you can actually turn off almost any television, radio or anything that uses infrared sensor. So, just like this. Now it's from transmitting different codes. Okay, so I've just turned the telly on. Okay, so we are at the end of the video and I'll just tell you something about it in general. You probably already know it if you watched the whole video. I love it! It's so, so good! I could just destroy my usual remote and use this as a remote and it's so nice replica from less than 200 euro. I, I mean, the Roberto or CT replicas cost 750 pounds excluding VAT, so it's so amazing. The metal replica with a flick action and everything. I. I I just can't believe I'm holding it in my hands. I really can't believe it. So yes, thanks for watching. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And leave a like. Goodbye.